Listen, everyone's going to want to be here, of course, in the Alamo City this weekend and really until next Sunday because it's Fiesta. So Viva Fiesta, everyone. It's early this morning. Get a cup of coffee while I talk about your weather and your traffic too. Stick around, guys. Here's your first live look around town. Yeah, we've got muggy conditions much like yesterday and warm conditions again as well. Sarah was just saying we're close to 70s. Actually, we're at 72 as well, too. So she was right, guys. 67 is that dew point. So it's very, very humid out there. The one thing we do have going for us is that our winds are light from the southeast at five miles an hour. And I just want to hold on those southerly winds for a moment because whenever we do pick up those southeasterly winds, whether it's breezy or not, the dew point tends to jump up because we're picking up a lot of moisture there from the Gulf. Kind of interesting. But of course, I want to show you your day first hour by hour. Here's what we've got going on. Temperatures, they're going to start to climb into those 70s. Uh, excuse me, we're already at 72, but we're going to stay there. And then throughout the day, we're getting up to about 77 by 1 p.m. We're working our way to about 80 degrees today. So yesterday, guys, we were in the 90s, but today it's going to look just a little bit different, noticeably different with that temperature, too. You're going to feel it. it's not going to be as uh, nasty outside. That's what I was calling yesterday with that humidity, guys. So temperatures across the region again right now uh, are really in those 70s and upper 60s, mid 70s down south already towards it's Catula. Now I don't see everything populating here for these wind gusts, but here's what I need you to know. They're not going to be significant at all today. Down south, though, we are picking up 21 mile per hour gusts from the southeast uh, in Catula and Carrizo Springs. A bit breezy there for Rock Springs and guys, a pressure gradient always starts to tighten there. So typically that's what we've got going on. It is very humid and you know, if the dew points don't make much sense to you, well, this will guys. We're at 72% of humidity in San Antonio really bumps up towards San Marcos at 80. 5%. I expect this to stay the same all day and into the weekend before a very steep drop. We are going to drop down that roller coaster, then climb right back up next week. So a cold front is moving through on Saturday night into Sunday. Because of that, we're going to see very breezy conditions from the north. And when they come from the north, we switch up uh, that narrative for our humidity levels. So future cast, what you want to know, is it going to rain today? Guys, very, very slight chance for rain. I don't think it's in the cards for us in San Antonio today. What it, you do have in the cards, just cloudy conditions. And then a little bit of a chance for showers tomorrow morning. Now, the first part of your day tomorrow is going to look quite different than the second part because of this right here. We do have a line of storms rolling through our area late tomorrow night. And we're only at a one out of five risk for anything to turn severe, so nothing significant at the moment. But if they do, we're looking at large to very large hail, of course, damaging winds as well. Again, you guys, this is not tonight. This is tomorrow night, so just need you to be aware of that. All right, we do have a few fronts on the way in the way of disturbances. Our GFS model shows us a lot of activity up in the northern hill country this weekend, too. Specifically, this breaks everything down for you for your seven day forecast again. 80 degrees today. You'll be dealing with a little bit of patchy fog out there. Now, as we take it into tomorrow, our Saturday, 78 degrees. We've got some showers, storms rolling in overnight into Sunday. We've got northeasterly winds 15 to 25 miles an hour. We have a slight cool down, at least for April, before we climb back up to almost above average by midweek. What a roller coaster we've got going on there for Fiesta.